Hey everyone, Lenny Bonds here from One Tech Stop, and I'm here to show you face unlock and motion sense in action. Now basically, face unlock has been around for a little while, obviously with the start of the iPhone and other Android devices now using it. This one's slightly different though. This one has a radar built in. So it's, I mean, Google dubs it as motion sense, which then, you know, detects when you're reaching for the phone, which makes it seem a lot faster to me. I don't have any like side to side comparisons, but I would say this is the fastest I have ever used. So basically when you reach for the phone, there's gonna be a little padlock on the top of the phone that detects you're reaching for it. And then the minute you raise it to your face, it unlocks immediately, no swiping to the home screen or anything. It goes straight there. The other thing I'll demonstrate is motion sense. Basically in the music app where I'll scroll to the left or scroll to the right to show how it works, you could skip tracks, you know, you could rewind them. I mean, basically go forward or backwards is what I'm trying to say. So this is on the blind, basically, you know, not an edited video, we're doing it live so you can see it in action. And if it fails, it fails. If it works perfectly, it works perfectly. So far it's been doing well for me. So let's see how it goes. So basically what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna reach for the phone. When I reach for the phone, it shows you this little padlock. When I reach it to my face, it unlocks automatically. So let's do that again, just to show you. I'll reach for the phone, it shows, it, it, it detects that I'm reaching for it. I lift it up, unlocks immediately. So we could do that in a little faster fashion, just to show you how fast it is. So I basically, I reach for the phone, grab it, and it unlocks. Simple, fast, and it works very well. Secondly, the rumor about it working with your eyes closed is 100% accurate. I've tried it a few times and it does unlock the phone with my eyes closed. I guess for security purposes, we could like um, question that. So that definitely does happen. I don't know if Google will fix that or keep it that way, but we'll see. Now for music, I'll go into my music and I'll show you over here what I mean. So let's just play some music. And you see this little glow on top? That's the motion sense. It's there ready for me to, it's basically ready to see what happens if I want to swipe. So if I swipe it, oh, well, you see, it didn't work that way because there's nowhere to go. I have to go this way first. So. This is how it works. You just swipe your hand across and it changes and it seems to be pretty smooth and work pretty well. So I could go back the other way now also. And I have to say it's pretty good. There it didn't. I guess you gotta get accustomed to the hand gestures and how you should move it. But basically this is face unlock and motion sense in action. You could also do it with um, the Pikachu wallpaper. You could wave your hand or act like you're tickling him and that will work. Um, I received this as a gift from Google. So far, I'm pretty happy with the device. We will have more coming in the next few days and in the upcoming weeks, a full review. I don't like to give a review after only a week because it's really hard to determine the battery once it settles, once it detects your usage and all that other stuff. So if you like this video, please hit, hit like and subscribe to us. This is Lenny Bonds from One Tech Stop signing off. Thank you.